I have gone through an extremely confusing phase of my life and I think you are also experiencing the same. What to do after BDS? There are so many questions. What to do after BDS? Should we set up our own clinic or should we do MDS? Should we offer non-clinical branches or we should go abroad? Should we practice as a dentist abroad or we should go for any course? If we should go for any course, what should we choose? Clinical or non-clinical and what not? All these questions start going in our head merry-go-round since, since the fourth year of our graduation. And sometimes many of us end up with nothing. I know, I know there are many people who have made up their mind and they actually know what they have to do. That is very good for them. And this is the video for the people who are confused like me. So here I am to make you stress free and confusion free. This video is for you guys who want to go abroad and want to do any specific course and is still confused which course to choose. So I will be telling and guiding you guys in this video about what course you should choose if you want to go abroad. So are you guys ready and excited? Then stay tuned till the end and let's get started. So if you are interested in such videos, then don't forget to hit the subscribe button and be the Dental Magic family. So in today's video, I will be talking about and telling you about which courses to choose after BDS abroad. I will be telling you the time span of the course, the fees of the course and the courses of course. So without any further delay, let's dig in. Coming abroad and studying is quite expensive. Along with that, there can be struggles in immigration that can be quite challenging at times. The decision is especially as important as to determine how you can manage your finances, staying abroad, staying away from your family in order to apply for the courses abroad. The first step of choosing the course is to take a decision for a long term. There are two scenarios. First, you have decided to come and do the course abroad and settle for the rest of your life. The second option is to do the course abroad and go back to your home country. So if you want to uh, go back to your home country, then I would suggest you to go for the option of MS. MS option is a very good option as it has a scope in your country too. The cost of this uh, uh, course, I would say it's the same or more or less a more here in abroad. Uh, moreover, it's same, I guess. Now, if you're thinking to choose for the non-clinical uh, course, then the tuition fees is less and substantial return on investment. Now, this was the scenario for if you are going back to your home country. What if you're staying here abroad and settling here for the rest of your life? What you will do? If you're staying here back in uh, abroad, let's talk about the specific uh, country. Let's talk about USA, right? So if you are coming and doing a course in USA, then if you do MS, then you are allowed to practice in certain states only. You are not free to work anywhere in USA. But, but after practicing for certain years, you are uh, eligible to practice anywhere after completing and giving the license exam. So after that, you can practice anywhere in the USA. So uh, along with that, here I want to give you a small disclaimer. The rules change now and then. So do your own research before applying for any of the courses. This is just my research. And this video is just for guiding you guys. So do your own research before getting on to something that you want to achieve in your life. We are talking about the courses to choose abroad and this video can be a bit lengthy if I started talking about the specific countries abroad like Canada, UK, USA, and Germany, France. So it will be a quite lengthy uh, video and you'll get bored definitely. So I will be covering up only USA in this video. So stay tuned till the end. 
so coming back to the topic so if you want to work across the usa and then you should choose uh, the dds course or dmd course along with the ms course and if you don't want to uh, get into the trouble of uh, studying all the way long for so many years then you can choose for dds or dmd uh, completely and uh, not doing ms and after dds or dmd you can also practice anywhere in the states so this was the step one for, for choosing the course abroad now coming to the step two now step two is decide for yourself whether you want to choose for the clinical dentistry field or non-clinical dentistry field as we all are aware that the dental schools abroad are really very expensive sometimes it's really hard to afford so some people tend to choose the non-clinical field of dentistry and save up the money initially and later on go for it so let's talk about uh, uh, the non-clinical branches that uh, you can offer if you are deciding to choose this course. So the first option for non-clinical field is the research. You can offer the medical or the dental research and the course duration is of about three to four years. And you can apply in the university for the PhD programs to get placement in the pharmaceutical companies. Or else you can work in the genetic development research programs also. And you will be glad to know that there are tons of different tech jobs in dentistry and medical as well. So let's talk about these tech jobs in medical and dentistry abroad. So the first course is medical transcription. I have I've also made a complete separate video for medical transcription. If you are interested in knowing that, then go and watch my video and I will provide the link in the description box below. So coming back to the topic, the medical transcription course, you can also do it from uh, abroad. And now coming to the time duration and the course fees. Uh, course duration is about six months to two years. The tuition fees is 2,500 to 12,000 pounds and the salary and after you complete this course and you join any certain company then you can earn up to 40,000 to 50,000 dollar per year yes now coming to the next course that is medical coder now let's dig in the time duration what salary you will get and the cost of this course so the time duration for this course is 12 weeks the tuition fees is around 1500 to 19000 dollar per year and after you complete the course you can earn up to 35000 to 45000 dollar per year for this course you need diploma or its equivalent certification from organization like american academy of professional the next is biomedical equipment technician these are the people uh, which repair the equipment in the hospital and nursing homes reduce the downtime in hospitals and the clinics so the course duration and the salary and the time duration about this course is the time let's talk about the time duration so the time duration for this course is 24 to 48 weeks. The tuition fees is around 24,000 to $48,000 per year. And after completing this course, you can earn up $52,000 to $85,000 per year. Now coming to the next course that is health information technician. These are the people who keep the health records for the organization and the hospitals. So now coming to the course duration, time and salary. Yes. So the first thing is the course duration. The course duration is of, of about two to four years. The tuition fees is around $10,000 to $25,000. And after completing the course, you can earn up to $50,000 to $90,000 per year. Yes, you heard me right. Isn't it great? The next is pharmacy technician. We haven't heard about this course in India, right? But these courses are available abroad and they are very, very easy to do. So these are the people, pharmacist technician are the people who are the main person, main go-to person between the customers and the pharmacist. Now coming to the course duration. The course duration is nine months to two years. The fees is around five thousand to ten thousand dollar per year and after completing the course you can earn up to thirty thousand to forty thousand dollar per year 
so these are some of the non clinical and uh, as i have mentioned earlier also it is the uh, technical jobs in medical, medical and dental fields that you can offer if you want to do any course abroad now let's talk about the other non clinical options so the other option is insurance claim examiner if you guys want to know about this in detail then comment down below now and i will i will come up with a video for you guys if, and one more thing that uh, the range of fees might change from one course to another course and might change from one college to another college and the fees range may also change from one year to the other year in the specific college that i am mentioning so please do your own research before getting into the course so the best thing is before getting into it just do your own research now coming back so the course duration the uh, insurance claim examiner course duration is of about 45 to 50 weeks and the fees is around 5000 to 10000 dollar and after doing this course you can if you get a job in a good company then you can earn up to hundred thousand two hundred and fifteen thousand dollar per year now other branches hospital or the healthcare related field that is mha so the course duration is two to three years the fees for the course is sixty thousand dollar per year and the salary that you can get after getting a job in a good company or a hospital is around ninety thousand to hundred thousand dollars per year and if you guys are interested in knowing about the mha courses abroad then already made a video for you guys so you can go and watch my video and i will provide the link in the description box below now without wasting time let's just jump into the clinical branches of dentistry that people most of the people are waiting for but before that i want to say that if you guys want to know the reason that you can tell to apply for the visa to come to the us then uh, comment down below and i will come up with the video for you guys so that you can get your visa easily now the first clinical branch is dental assistant so the course duration is 16 weeks to 9 months the fees is around three thousand uh, dollar to thirteen thousand dollar and after completing this course you can earn up to you can get the salary up to forty thousand to fifty thousand dollar per year now coming to the next clinical course that is dental hygienist the course duration for the dental hygienist is the time duration for the course is four years and the fees is around $25,000 to $30,000 and the salary that you can get after completing this course is around $90,000 to $100,000 per year. Now coming to the main aspect that most of the people want to do and practice in abroad in USA or in UK or in Canada is to practice as a dentist that they have studied for years so the fees is twenty to fifty thousand dollars the time duration is around two to three years the salary that the salary that you can get after doing this course is around 150 to two fifty thousand dollar per year so these were the clinical uh, courses that you can offer the along with the fees and the salary that you will earn after completing your course comment down below now if you guys are interested in knowing the step-by-step -step guide how you can apply as a dentist in usa and i will come up with a video for you guys don't forget to come in then and again one very important aspect that i want to remind you again fees that i have mentioned in all of the aspect doesn't count your living expenses it's completely and wholly about your tuition fees of the course so don't think that I am telling you the whole estimation of your living and studies. No, it is just just your tuition fees of the course. Okay, so if you want to go abroad and do the course, just do your research, maintain a balance, expenses and the finances before going ahead. Just make your own plan. Okay, so that you don't get hassle and get worried about in future. I hope this video is helpful for you in any way 
and comment down below and let me know in what course you are interested and you want to do the course and you want to go abroad with that further course i will be eagerly waiting for your comments and for your choice of course so that's it for the video i hope you liked it if you did then don't forget to share with your friends and family and if you liked it and if you're interested in such videos then and feel free to hit the like button subscribe my channel and be the dental magic family thank you for watching the video till and stay tuned till the next video till then stay safe be happy i love it